Hello. Hi, good evening. <laughs> Hello. Oh, sorry. I was trying to answer your uh, this one. All right. Uh, hold on. Let, can you please wait for me? <laughs> Let me type the number 41. I am on number 41 now. All right, there we go. Okay, so let me see. Oh, hi! <laughs> Your brother. <laughs> okay. Ah, did you need to pass the answer for this one today? Okay. Uh-huh. All right. Okay. Okay, so number 42, it takes Nin two hours to do his homework every day. Nin, okay. Uh, let me send it here. Okay. Oh, do, do you need the answer for this one? Do, do you need the answer for this one right now? Mm -hmm. Oh, hello? Okay, do you need the answer for this one right now? Uh, yeah. All right, okay, so uh, let me help you with, with this one. Okay, so what is that? Number 42. This is 42. 42. Mm -hmm. Means, pens, pens. Two hours. Two hours. To do his homework. To finish. His homework. Alright, so let me type, type number 42 on the chat box. On the Zoom chat box. Can you see it? Okay, 43. My uh, mother yes. used to make. Us clean, uh, my mother used to make us clean the house. We use okay, this is for number 43. 43. We use to clean the house. Okay, my mother used. Uh, can you write in a messenger? Oh, in the messenger. All right. All right. So let me open my messenger. Oh, is it okay with you that I help you with this one? <laughs> I will help you first. All right, hold on. Okay, so I will send the other. <laughs> Hello, brother. <laughs> You're very cute. Okay, so I'll send the other um, answers while we're having our class, okay? Okay. Okay, so welcome back. It's good to see you again. Oh, wow, what happened to that one? Let me just... Uh, turn off the other icons that I am not using. Oh, here one. Let me turn that one off. And also this one. And all right. Okay. So let's have, uh, I think let's have a uh, supplementary activity. Okay. So this is for listening. All right. So... Okay, so please get a paper and a pen. Okay, since you can't use the annotate for Zoom, uh, let's stick with paper and pen. Okay, so please uh, shopping. Okay, so let's have a great day listening. Sorry, day 11, and this is shopping. Mm hmm. Oh, I think we are finished with this one. Hold on. 11, 12. Let's have 12. Okay. 
Mm okay. All right, so while we're having with this one, I'll help you with your homework. Uh, so first, uh, let's have new words. Okay. All right. Okay. So these words, maybe some of these words are not new to you. Maybe some of these words, yeah, you already know some of these words. And if you are not familiar with that, a Vietnamese translation is in this site, okay? <laughs> Hello. How old is your brother? Oh, you're very cute. Uh-huh. Do you want to do, do you also want to learn English? <laughs> okay. Okay, so first word is um a receptionist. Okay, first word is receptionist. A receptionist. Very good. Next is um, register. All right, please repeat that. Register. Uh, res register. All right, okay. Uh, okay, one more time. Register. Register. Okay, uh, this, this part is start. Register. Register. All right, very good. That sounds much better, my dear. Okay, one more time. Register. Register. All right, very good. Okay, good one. Next is patient. Uh, patient. All right. Okay, next word. Can you please read the next word? Contact address all right very good okay what about the next one height and then the next what uh, uh, okay uh, this one is weight all right next one national health very good and then this is number okay the next one Prime. Okay, this is print. Print. Very good. And this one is? Uh, registration. All right. Okay, nice try. Uh, registration. Registration. Uh, registration. All right. Tration. Hmm. Okay, tration. Tration. Very good. Registration. Registration. Okay, uh, that sounds much better. Okay, so remember, remember me. All right, so we have structure here. We use the word need plus the infinity form of the birth or the dictionary form of the birth or need plus the noun okay all right so let's have an example for the first structure okay uh, let's say i need to um, to take a shower yeah, I need to take a shower. I can smell myself. <laughs> All right. I need to take a shower. Okay, so this is the first form of the verb. I need to take the shower or the first structure. The need plus to or the infinitive verb. Now, let's have need plus the noun. I need... Oh, I need you, girl. I need... Apples. I need uh, apples. Okay, apples. Very well. Apples is a noun. And this one, to take a shower, that is verb. All right. Now, can you make your own example with the same pattern? Okay, uh, verb first, this one. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Ooh. Uh, okay, this one first. With, the, with this pattern. 
uh, I need I mm -hmm. Oh, hello? Hello? Oh, you, your internet is not good. Hello? Hello, welcome back. Yeah. All right, so this one I need to. I need uh, I need to uh, do my homework. All right, very well. I need to do my homework. What about the need plus noun? Mm, I need rice. I need rice. <laughs> <laughs> Are you hungry? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Actually, my family is already having uh, dinner right now because, let me see, what time is it? It's already 7 here in the Philippines. So yeah, they, they are having their dinner. Okay, so we have here, oh! Dancing. Okay, she's good at dancing. <laughs> and it's very cute. Uh, let's re uh, let's read the example uh, provided by the Pantado. Okay, I'm. I'm too fat. I need to lose weight. Okay, lose. Lose weight. Weight. Very good. Oh, did did you guys already back in school? In, in the Vietnam, mm -hmm. students are. Um, in, in regular classes now? Uh, uh, primary and secondary not go to school and uh, university and uh, junior... Uh, junior high school? Yes, uh, go to school. Oh, so you, you go to school? No. Oh, you are in secondary? Yeah. Oh, I see. Then why do you have a homework? Mm. Because uh, my teacher... Uh, Send? Hmm. Because my teacher uh, asks. Oh, oh, your teacher asks you to do the homework. Yeah. Oh, I see. <laughs> All right. Oh, I, I was thinking earlier if I give you a homework. Okay. Mm, you got 14 min. Oh, alright. Oh, that is. 
Okay, so next is I want. Uh, please read. I want to play. I want to play my friends a song so I need a guitar. All right. So for this one, I need a guitar. Okay. So this is the um, need plus the noun. Guitar is a noun. All right. Okay. So let's do some exercise. Okay, so this is for exercise number one. Let me see. I think, ah, this one don't have the, um, what is that? The listening selection. So exercise number two. Ooh. Oh, oh, I see. They haven't, um, Change that one. I already asked them to change that one because it don't have the audio. So let's let's have number 13 or lesson 13. This one got an audio. Okay, again. Uh, let's see the... Okay, so listen to six conversation between uh, patients and medical specialists. Identify the treatment suggested by the medical practitioner in each conversation. So again, this is listening um, activity. So if you feel like you need a paper and a pen, feel free to use it, okay? And then we will answer it afterwards. All right? So you have to take note or to write down the uh, treatment, the suggested treatment by the doctors, okay? Uh, okay, are we good? Yes. All right, so you will hear that on uh, here, on the audio. Ready? I've just been feeling really stressed lately. I'm shouting at my family, and I start crying at the smallest thing. I'm so tense all the time. Can you give me something to make me feel more relaxed? Well, I'm not the kind of doctor who will prescribe drugs for something that just requires a change in lifestyle. What do you do for pleasure these days? I don't know. I watch some TV in the evenings. Do you get much exercise? No. But I watch my weight. I don't overeat. That's not the point. Exercise isn't just about losing weight. It's about relaxation, getting some fresh air, and being involved in an activity that you have some control over. It helps you to clear your mind. So what I want you to do for the next week is do at least 30 minutes of physical activity every day. It doesn't matter what, just so long as you're getting your heart rate up. All right. Again. What? Yeah. Uh-huh. Finish? No, I want to listen, uh, listen to again. All right. I've just been feeling really stressed lately. I'm shouting at my family, and I start crying at the smallest thing. I'm so tense all the time. Can you give me something to make me feel more relaxed? Well, I'm not the kind of doctor who will prescribe drugs for something that just requires a change in lifestyle. What do you do for pleasure these days? I don't know. I watch some TV in the evenings. Do you get much exercise? No, but I watch my weight. I don't overeat. That's not the point. Exercise isn't just about losing weight. It's about relaxation, getting some fresh air and being involved in an activity that you have some control over. It helps you to clear your mind. So what I want you to do for the next week is do at least 30 minutes of physical activity every day. It doesn't matter what, just so long as you're getting your heart rate up. <gasps> All right. 
Okay, so what 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 should uh what should the woman do? Uh, doing exercise. All right, do exercise. What else? What what about drinking medicine or taking medicine? Uh, eat salad. Uh, eat it is it uh, sh should she take medicine or not? Uh, shouldn't. Okay, shouldn't. All right. Uh, what about um, stay at home and uh, stay at home and sleep. Okay. What about uh, take physical activity like walking? Very nice. Good job. All right. Okay, next. All right, so that is the warm-up exercise. Now we got uh, new words here. Okay, so this one is, uh, can you please read this one for me? Uh, tent. Okay, very good. So this is the meaning of tents in Vietnamese, okay? Next is? Right. Uh, start okay. you. Okay, uh, let me help you. Uh, prescribe. 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 All right, very good. Next. Mm, drunk. Okay, frog. Next. Lifestyle. All right, lifestyle. Lifestyle. Very good. Next. Over, over it. All right. Okay, this one is? Lose weight. All right, very good. The last one is? Physical activity. Okay. Oh, the physical activity in Vietnamese is very long. Uh, this is the meaning of physical activity in Vietnamese. <gasps> it's quite long. No, it's uh, it mean an example. Oh, example! Oh, I see. I thought that is a physical exercise, a physical activity in Vietnamese. Okay, now. So we have here structure. Okay, to be or get involved in something. Okay, so this one. I hope you understand this one, right? Okay. Yeah. Now, okay. All right. Let's have an example. Uh, please read. Uh, Tuan Tuan is involved in football club in school. All right. Very good. Oh. Okay. So now let's have an example or let's create our own example. Okay. Okay, uh, what? Mm -hmm. I, uh, I am not involved in dance club in school. Okay, oh, in dance club at school. All right, very good. Okay, very well. Next, ah, subject one, verb one, plus as long as, plus subject two, plus verb two. What is this? Better house. Okay, so let's let's have this that a structure. So on that structure we have subject one plus verb one, and then the word as long as plus subject two and verb two. Okay, now let's have this one. Okay, so as long as, here, here, as long as. Okay, so this is the subject one. Do not stop. Okay, verb one. It doesn't matter how slowly you go. Okay, subject one and... Whatever. 
how slow did you go? All right, it's not fast. Very fun. Okay, now let's create our okay our own example through this one. Okay, so again, subject one, subject one, and then verb one plus the word as long as. Okay, pl oh, plus subject one and verb one. All right. So think of your example while I am creating mine. Oh, sorry, there's something on my eyes. Not alive. Uh, uh, what is that word? Okay, so here is my example. This this one is quite long. Okay, let me see. Oh, let me put it here. Here. All right. Okay, so subject one, I, verb should. Okay, as long as I, breathing is a verb. All right. Okay, I should not stop dreaming. As long as I am breathing, I will dream. Okay, what, what about you? Can you make your own example? Um, Mm -hmm. Okay, so let me help you out. I will not stop on studying. Okay, I will not stop on studying studying okay as long as okay can you can you make the latter part i will not stop studying as long as uh, Or do, do you have um, other idea? Mm. All right. As long as I will not stop studying as long as I... Uh, so as, as so long as or as long as... Okay, so long. Uh, oh, this one is not, not, uh, well, what is this? Uh, this one is not correct. This, this one should be as long as. Mm -hmm. Not, not so long as. All right, there's a typographical error with that one. Mm 
Mm -hmm. I will not stop studying. As long as, uh, do you think the word I can is suitable or is, is it okay to use? Oh, hold on. Let me, okay, hold on. Let me. Okay, sorry for that. That is my student for the next period, but the, he is very early. Hold on. Let me lock the meeting room, okay? So he, he can't enter. Uh, I think so long as it's correct. So long as? Yeah. Mm, well, why is it? It does not matter how slowly you go, so long as you do not stop. Mm -hmm, all right. Okay, so why, why don't you use uh, so long as? Okay, so why don't you use so long as? And I'll uh, get, mm -hmm, I'll, I'll go back to this one. I'll check it. Mm -hmm. Wait, Uh, because as long as in the cage, the equality. Mm -hmm. So I think uh, so long as is correct. All right, Jackie. So please uh, use uh, so long as. Yeah. All right. Mm. Mm. No, uh, actually, uh, as long as it means that it could also means that provided that. That is the other term for provided that. Provided that. Okay. As long as that is also term for uh, provided that and yes in my dictionary as long as provided that and so long as they deposit the same meaning okay it means that we could uh, the three of them they have the same function and we could use them in a sentence on the same on the same sentence Okay, let me type it down. Uh, provided that. Oh, are you translating it in Vietnamese? Uh, are you translating it in Vietnamese? I think um, if you're using Google Translate, sometimes translation from English to Vietnamese is not accurate when you use Google Translate. Uh, that, that might be the problem why... why uh, you find it difficult to make a sentence because you translate it from Vietnamese to uh, English. All right. Uh, always remember that yes, a translation for in Google Translate is not accurate 
as you as when you say it in English. All right. So, but, but let me help you. Okay. So think of your sentence if you are more comfortable using so long as. Okay, because so long as might have different meaning in Vietnamese and as long as might have different meaning also in Vietnamese. And also, uh, provided that might have different meaning also in Vietnamese. All right? But in English, uh, provided that, okay, as long as, so long as we will use them in the same category, all right? Okay, so it means that, yeah, for example, as well. Oh, this one is as well, as well as her father. That is as well. Mm-hmm. Okay, so let me see. Use for comparison, like as long as, as well as, is also used in form of an equivalent. Yes. Oh, hello? Hello? Yeah. Oh. Yes, your, your video is stopping. All right, if you are comfortable using so long as, uh, please use it in a sentence. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. I don't think we can do. Ah, uh, uh, you, you don't think that? Yeah. Uh, please, please repeat, you don't think that? Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't quite catch that. Uh, the latter part. I, I, please repeat, I don't think. Uh, no. Uh, I didn't think of that oh 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 you you can't think of example yet yeah all right i see okay so i have here uh this one came from cambridge dictionary all right so let me share my screen with you so everything will be clear with you all right okay oh oh well, why am i on facebook okay so hold on <gasps> Uh, I think my laptop is lagging because of too many tabs that I opened. Yeah, it, it's lagging. All right. So when do we use as long as? All right. So I find an explanation here in Cambridge Dictionary, which might um, here help you by the way where did you get that one the one that you where is that that, that you sent to me okay I will, where did you get this one uh, the one that you sent to me okay so it says here that uh on your on the the definition that you sent to me uh as long as 
is used for comparison, okay? Like as long as, as well as, okay, yes, they are the same, is also used in the form of an equivalent comparison with the as plus the adverb as structure. Okay, let me see. Hmm. Okay, so we use, this came from Cambridge Dictionary, uh, we use as to refer to intended duration of a plan or idea. Okay, most commonly referring to the future. Okay, and we use present simple to refer to the future uh, after the as long as. Okay, so that is the uh, structure for that. Present simple, present simple, that is the uh, one subject or present simple plus the, uh, this one, as long as the structure. And then, I'll write. Okay, yeah, as long as. You're allowed to go as long as you let us know when you arrive. Okay, let me see. So long as. Oh, we are over time. I think I will give you a module for this one so you, you could understand better. Uh, when do we use so long, so long, long as. Okay, so let's see so long as. Ah. Let me clear all of this one. Okay, so long as and so long as. As long as and all right. Let me see. Okay, here, how do we use so long as? Oh, yes, they, they got the same meaning. As long as or so long as, it also means provided that or on condition that. Mm -hmm. Yes, the, this is the example that we had earlier. All right, so in sum summarization, so long as, as long as, and provided that they have the deficit, the same use in English language. All right, uh, it's already time, my dear, and I have another class. But next meeting, I will give you a deeper explanation for this one. All right? Yeah. Okay, so I will send you some... Uh, materials to read later so you could you could read it okay okay you can uh, have your uh, yes can we take a break next meeting because Sunday I go to uh, travel Oh, you, you go to? Uh, traveling. Oh, you will travel on Sunday. So that is March 8th, right? Yeah. Okay, so let me mark here. Okay. All right, maybe next Thursday. Okay, goodbye. All right, goodbye.